Right then, hello and welcome back to Green's Video Glory. This is episode 55 and this is for sure the biggest episode that has ever been in this series. If we win this next game against West Brom, we will be in the Premier League next season. Now, if you're watching this and you have not subscribed yet, please do. If you're watching this in the Premier, right, in the chat now with me, put your predictions for the score in. We lost to West Brom very recently. Very recently, it was a big loss for us. So put your put your predictions in the chat now. If you're watching this after the fact, put them in the comments and don't cheat. That's just a bit boring, isn't it? Other than that, there's not much else to say. Rizzo wants to play, but he's not going to. Wood's been on fire. Let's get to the team. Let's see how we're going to do. Come on. Realistically, there was never going to be anyone else starting this except the first 11. Everyone's fully fit except Thomas. So then has got his chance to write himself into Grimsby history in the biggest game in Grimsby's, Grimsby's history by far. It's massive. This is huge. I can't believe I'm out of doing this. Are you guys ready? Because I'm definitely not. Jesus. It's the richest game in football, lads. It's Wembley Stadium. It's Grimsby. It's West Brom. I can't believe we're about to do it. If we if we don't make it. I don't even know if we, what happens if we don't make it. I'm glad we are the home team and in our home kit because that is the kit I'm wearing. FIFA 21, you will see me in face cam. I promise. FIFA 21, you'll see that. You'll see me in the kit. I promise you. They're in their away kit. That's the trophy we'll be lifting. Let's go and do it. Let's go and get this done. Oliver kicks us off in the final. This is huge. Oh, it's been such a cagey opening, but Wood. And Oliver is even back there. He's not done well. Dembele's going to have to get back with the pace. It's a good ball over. I thought that was going to fly in early on. Who's that? Togni. I thought he was going to power that in. Jesus. I don't normally say that a lot. Um, but I'm just I'm nervous, lads. To be honest, I don't know if you are watching this as well as much as I am. But my words are going to get mixed up, and things are just not going to go as smoothly as possible. But hopefully they do. Clifton then in the middle is going to force Fossey forward with the through ball to make him play and make him run. Back to Clifton, good touch. Oliveira, Lopez is in the space. One touch and a strike from the edge. It's a good deflection. That should be a corner. Oliveira winning the ball back high up the pitch. This is just what we need. Giles Cook trying to go round, someone hasn't managed yet, and he's dropped down with an injury, that's so annoying, 20 minutes in. But then the Giles Cook still playing on with his injury, into Clifton, into Oliveira. Back to Clifton, we're in on goal, it's our first chance, it's a good save. Oh, we need to score that, Lopez has been turned, it's gone to Togni. It's gone backwards, Giles Cook still running with that injury, Malejo. Back to Biol. This is just as we're coming to the end of half time, I am bricking it, lads. Oh, they've had brilliant possession of the ball, back to Togni, Pollock steps in though. Just added time. Hughes. Come on, let's get let's get a counter going. Let's get a counter going. Ah, oh, Townsend steps in well. Surely that's the end of the half though. There it is, half time whistle. Right. Nervy. If we'd scored that Clifton chance, I'd be feeling a little bit better. But it's nil-nil. We did better than the league game, but I'm still I'm not I'm not comfortable. I'm gonna give Charles Cook another little while on the injury. He seems to still be playing okay. Um, he's not dropping his speed too much or anything like that, so I'm gonna keep him on there. And we're doing better in the stats as well at half time, so we're on top. Pollock up to Lopez, that's a good ball. Oliveira, he's not had a good game today and he's still not done it. Big game and he's not really doing it for us today. West Brom playing some nice football, it's a lovely ball to Malejo. Back to Townsend who plays it over, Edmondson should win it. It's not a solid header though, Wood clears. Dembele with a bit of room, sees Charles Cook with some more room. We'll go up to Oliveira, that's a poor pass. We need to make these things stick, I think chances just aren't happening. Agpom now for West Brom with a bit of space. Edmondson's had to step out. Back to Agpom. Charles Cook will go close. Malejo is still with Agpom. Togni's in there. Oh, Fossey will get an interception. It's good. Lopez to Clifton. Clifton to Charles Cook. Still on that injury, but he's turned really well. He'll go into Oliveira, who's managed to actually turn his defender. Can he get back? No, he can't. Use. Back to Oliveira. Turn and shoot. It's in the bottom corner. Esmond Oliveira's done nothing. Nothing all game. We got a bit lucky there with that deflection, just dropping to Hughes. Oh my god, I'm buzzing. Yes, 1-0 up, 20 minutes left. Tense, tense times. It just bounces there as Oliveira tries to drag it. Hughes plays as Oliveira and he does finish from the penalty spot, as he would. And I feel for Charles Cook with that injury, but he is going to come off and young Ed King's coming on. What a time. What a time to be a young player. Right, we'll start again. There's about 20 minutes left. We just need to hold it out. West Brom have had nothing today. Get ourselves a second and the game's won. Togni into Agpom. Back to Togni. Edmondson in well. Togni with Pollock out. Poli. Into Biol. Oh, he's turned Edmund uh, Lopez even. 
Ratcliffe to then to Harper. Out come up with Edmondson going in. Fossey gets a tackle. It goes to Fossey. I was trying to die with Edmondson, not not uh, Fossey, but I'll take it. We've got the ball. Lopez crossing the halfway line with the ball. Plays it up for Oliveira, who's going to be able to run away from Abram. Hold on. Hold on now. Hold on now. Lopez is the ball. Finish it, Lopez. It's 2 0. Goonsby are going to the Premier League, lads. We're going. We're going up. It's done. Lopez gets a goal. Oliveira turns up just when you need him. I was saying. I was saying he hasn't played. He has been playing poor all game. And then he just absolutely breezes past. Waits, waits, picks the pass. Lopez finishes the pass. What a shot. What a goal. I can't believe it, lads. This is it. Grimsby are going up. It's late enough as well that it, we could start the party now. Oliveira's won the ball back. He's won the ball back. Oh, he's going through. Oh, he's lost it. But we could start the party. There's five minutes left. We're 2 0 up. This is it. There's added time. West Brom are playing the ball around the back. They know they haven't got the time. They haven't got it. They don't have it, lads. Dembele will win that. And that's it. Surely, ref. Ed King. He's not really had the ball since he's come on, but now he has. Look at this run from a young man into Oliveira. Clifton's coming up. Oh, what a touch and a finish. Oh, it's a terrible shot, but it doesn't matter. Because there goes the full-time whistle. I can't believe we've done it. Oh, we've done it. Yes, lads. Absolute scenes. All of the celebrations. That is a hundred million pounds in the bank as well with that win. Premier League football next season. Oh my lord. There's the man of the match in my opinion. Esteban Oliveira turns up out of nowhere to do to do absolute scenes. Score a goal. Assist another. Matty Pollock picks up the trophy. And he's going to lift it high because Grimsby are going to the Premier League. How many times have I said that? But we are. I apologise if the audio or anything's crackled while we were winning that. Oh, Lord. Best, best feeling in the world. This absolute... I can't, I just can't describe it. This is fantastic. You know what this feels like? I was there when Chelsea won the Champions League in 2012. This feels just like that. I've made a real connection to this team. All of those players are absolute legends for the club. Legends, all of them. And you can't forget the final little team photo with the trophy. Everyone's buzzing. Charles Cook's there despite going off. The only player that's missing is so unfortunate is Callum Thomas. He's had a fantastic season. I feel for him not being there today. But this is the picture we all wanted to see. Grimsby Town, 2-0 in the final, two goals in the final 20 minutes as well. You can't beat it, lads, you can't beat it. And Grimsby Town will be playing Premier League football next season. Season 5 is the Premier League. And as I forgot it in the last episode, we'll just do a little quick, little, little quick bit, everyone's favourite little bit, and you know who's won it. I don't know if there's any point even making this a reveal today for this episode. It's Esteban Oliveira, isn't it? Yeah, I, I said it in, in the game. I was like, he's not played well today. And he hasn't. He didn't. 60 odd minutes, didn't play well. Suddenly, out of nowhere, he finishes a goal. And it puts us on fire. And then he just breezes past for the next player. Bang, Lopez finishes it. And we're in the Premier League. And it is all down to Esteban Oliveira. There's, there, there's no other player who could be getting that today. I was thinking, oh, I forgot to do it for the last episode. I put it in the comments. But, but man. Esteban Oliveira. Without him, where would we be? Let's have a check now. Just see, final look at the table, and then a look at a look at the teams we'll be playing next year as well. So as you can see, then yes, we finished fourth, but we are promoted. We will be up in the Premier League with Crystal Palace and with Burnley. I can't believe it. Can't believe it. Thank God we've made that. Really needed it. Really needed it. We know who's gone down. Next, next RTG, Luton Town have gone down to League One, but we'll be taking them from the Championship and we'll be going up from there because they did do a great escape and you do love to see it. I'll just have a quick look at the Premier League. Now, I wouldn't normally, this isn't something I normally do, but I would just like to check how the season went here and I brought it down for the bottom, obviously. Brentford, who had somehow managed to make it up and so did Notts Forest. Rads, if you're ever watching this, there you go, mate. You managed to make it. But you have been relegated along with Brentford and Southampton. So we'll be playing Bournemouth, Villa, Brighton, Sheffield United, Fulham, Wolves, Watford, Leicester, West Ham, Newcastle, Everton, Arsenal, Man United, Spurs, Chelsea, Liverpool and City. All the big teams all coming to Blundell Park and we've got to go there. Or oh, it's going to be a season. City won the league with 105 points. Absolutely mad. But that's it today, lads. That's it for season four. We'll be doing, I'll be doing the roundup. I'll be doing the awards and all that. That'll come next week. At some point, I don't know, we'll be full into Grimsby soon, lads. If you've liked it, please do 
leave a like, subscribe. Appreciate you watching. Everyone who, who's here with the premiere, I appreciate you guys as well. Especially, really thanks for that. This is the support on this has been mad, and I'm going to keep it going until FIFA 21 or until we win the Champions League. So let's hope we win the Champions League. Unreal stuff, lads. That's it for today. And I'll see you all in the next one. But wait, if you haven't heard already, I'm involved in an online career mode Super League with respect to Jeff, Maxwell and JJ Loza, three great creators. This is such a great idea and we're doing a live draft to pick our teams for this whole season on respect to Jeff's YouTube's now. It'll be also on Maxwell's Twitch and it'll be on JJ Loza's Twitch as well. Maybe even my Twitch if I get it up and running, who knows? It's at 8pm tonight uh, for those in the premiere, August 30th for everyone else who's not. If you've missed it, go and check it out. There'll be a highlight of it. And then all the games for the season will be streamed live on the creators channels everyone's links going to be in the description of their youtube and their twitch if they've got twitch of course this is one you do not want to miss get on it now and i will see you in the draft